strangers. Kidnapping is when an adult tries to take you against your will. Mm -hmm. It's important not to go to places by yourself, especially if they're quiet and secluded. Stay with the group, okay? Yes! What should you do if an adult grabs you and tries to take you? I don't know you! Don't, don't touch, touch me. me! Someone help me! Very good! Don't forget that! The toy shop should be getting the Ultra Dragon in today! Then let's go! <laughs> and I'm gonna get the first one! Because I know a shortcut! <laughs> uh, it's kinda dark... Hey, kid! <gasps> Attention! Huh? Uh, what did you do that for? The teacher just told us not to go in secluded places alone. Uh, Johnny, the Super Dragon comes out today. That's where I'm going. Whoa, Super Dragon? Yeah, I'll see you there. Huh? Hold on, wait for me. Take a look at this. There was an attempted kidnapping in the next town. Huh? The suspect's face was caught on camera. He seems like a nice grandpa. He doesn't seem scary at all. Kidnappers aren't always scary-looking strangers. It could be someone who seems very nice or someone the child already knows. To be safe, I'll increase my patrols. Please be vigilant. Sure, sure thing. thing. <clears throat> Here, chocolate ice cream just for you. Thank you so much. By the way, are you all alone? Jesse, uh -huh. are you ready? Mm -mm. I was so close! No one leaves their kids alone anymore these days. <gasps> Hold up! There's ice huh? cream! <laughs> no, Johnny! We need to leave! We can eat it really quick! Come oh, on, Johnny, not come now! Come get your but free ice so cream today! Huh? Free ice cream? Uh, here you are, my friend. Thank you so much! So, what are your names, gentlemen? I'm Johnny, and my friend's name is Peter. <laughs> They're making this too easy. Oh, you wouldn't happen to like cats. I found a stray kitten the other day. Maybe you'd like to have him. I Give love him cats. Can I'll I take him home? Why don't you go look at him? Wow. Follow me. Johnny, you're allergic to cats, remember? I'll take him home. Peter, you already have Buddy at home. He won't be happy with a cat. I guess not. We can't take him after all. Uh, uh, that's all right. I need to go to the post office anyway. You don't happen to know the way. Sure we do. No one knows Broomstown better than we do. Well, then hop in and you can show me. Sure. <laughs> Hold on. Huh? The Super Dragon. <laughs> oh, that's right. We should go now. <sighs> Sorry, mister. Uh, Thanks for the ice cream. Wait. Oh, oh my stomach. Oh, the agony. Hold on. Are you all right? I don't know what's wrong. If you could Here, help... I got you. <sighs> Wait, let's call the rescue team. Huh? Rescue team? No, oh, no. Come here. Uh, uh, Stop struggling uh, and get in the truck. Let me go. <sighs> let's go. Put me down. Somebody help. Peter. Help. Help. Huh? What, what is, is that? that? Somebody. Somebody, please help. It's Johnny. Stop. <clears throat> I don't want yeah, just get in there and keep quiet. Get... Let go. Get your hands off him. Looks like I better get out of here. Stop. Are you all right? Stay there. You're in a lot of trouble, sir. Oh, I need a lawyer. Dad! <laughs> Are you okay? I'm so glad you're safe now. Hey, you guys. That was a close call, huh? We're glad you're all right. Mm. Remember, if a stranger offers to buy you a toy or a treat, you have to say no and walk away. If someone you don't know asks for directions or to help find a lost pet, tell them you can't help and again walk away. Someone may tell you that a family member is sick. Under no circumstances should you go with him. Instead, check with your family and tell them what's happening. Understand? Yep, thank, thank you, Amber. Amber. Oh, no, wait! The Super Dragon! Oh, oh, I really wanted it. Then should we go get it right now? Huh? Really? Hey, Dad, <sighs> can we go together? Yes, of course. <laughs> You're the best! Woo! Best dads ever! 
Shouting fire. Watch closely. Wow! Awesome! Joni, you're the best! <laughs> that magic is just kid stuff, please. Says you! Get ready for some real magic. <gasps> and ta-da! Oh. Oh, thanks, Peter! And that <gasps> is called a real magic trick. <laughs> Guys, huh? check it out! Spooky is doing a magic show. Wow! <laughs> Wait! It looks like so much oh, fun! I am so there! <laughs> huh? Huh. There. Spooky, it's all done. Thanks a lot, Roy. Now I feel safe. Listen, one little mistake can result in a really big fire. Until the show's done, you should be very careful. Well, I'll see you later then. Bye, Roy. <laughs> Spooky! Oh, Peter. What's happening? <laughs> Spooky, let me be your assistant. You? Nah, thanks. Magic isn't for everyone. <laughs> Spooky, just watch. <laughs> what do you think? Good, right? Oh. Hmm? Mm, I just still can't. Huh? I'm begging you, Spooky. I want to learn your awesome fire trick more than anything else in the world. <clears throat> yeah, the fire trick is pretty awesome. <laughs> I'll say, it's the best magic trick in the entire town! No, wait, in the entire world! <laughs> All right, fine. Come to think of it, it could be really nice having an assistant. Thank you, Spooky! <laughs> This'll be great! I'm excited! Wow! Gosh, I can hardly believe it! I can't mm -hmm. believe how many of my friends mm. came! I'm over the moon! <laughs> We practiced really hard for this, so let's give them the best show ever. Hmm. <laughs> Everybody will be so surprised to see me on this stage. <laughs> huh? huh? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Spooky's Magic Show! And here he is, Spooky! Howdy, everyone! Welcome to Spooky's World of Magic! <laughs> The trick you've all been waiting for, Spooky's Incredible Magic Fire Show! <laughs> Spooky, good luck! Wow! Peter, good job! <laughs> Since you were smart enough to yell fire, we were able to evacuate. It was nothing. Listen, here are some tips of what to do if a fire breaks out. If there is a fire, shout fire to let everyone know of the danger. Then, you should find and pull the fire alarm as quick as you can. If you can't find the alarm, make loud noises to let people know they're in danger. Lastly, if you are inside, throw things out the window or wave clothes so people will know you're there. Then, when people realize that someone's in danger, they can take action. Mm -hmm. We won't we'll forget, forget it, Roy! Huh? <sighs> we practiced really hard for this, so let's give them the best show ever. Spooky, Aww. I know you're upset. It was the biggest magic show of your whole life. Spooky, cheer up! I thought the show was awesome. He's right, so you should try not to be too upset. Hmm? <laughs> Kids, huh? guess what? Bye!
Slam! It's Spooky's even bigger, biggest magic show. It's tomorrow. Tell all your friends. What? An even and bigger, bigger, biggest, biggest magic, magic show? We, we can't, can't wait! wait. <laughs> <laughs> How to Ride Safely <laughs> Wow! Are those jet speed inline skates? That's awesome! Doug, are they yours? Yeah, of course they're mine. And with these bad boys, I'll skate across the universe! Whoa, awesome! awesome. <laughs> You're kidding me! You're going to fight a space uh, monster in your skates? Why? Just because you're jealous? What? Of those things? My scooter could leave those skates in the dust anytime. Oh, yeah? No, it can't. Oh, you better believe it can. Fine. At 4 o'clock, we're racing. I'll see you then at the park. Huh. Kevin. <sighs> Doug. Are you at it again? Jenny, Jenny uh, you, you should, should judge, judge our, our race. <sighs> Aww. What's wrong with you guys? Ask Nothing wrong yeah. with me. And so, we should take all of the square corners and make them rounded like these. And that way, it'll be easier to go in and out. In addition to just doing that, this should also cut down on blind mm -hmm. spots. You're absolutely right. Okay, then. Let's all get out there and get to work. Okay. okay. <laughs> Mom! Have you seen my scooter? Uh, I can't find it anywhere. Don't you remember? You threw huh? it away because it got broken. Oh, that's right. Think. Think. Huh? Uh, I... Oh, uh, oh, man. Can I really beat Doug with his dumb little scooter? Huh? I won't fall. I'm okay. <laughs> you have to use a stick and you think you can outrace me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're really going to race on that baby scooter? Well, I'm faster than you no matter what I'm riding on. Fine. Then let's start the race now. Fine with me. Okay. Ready? Set? Go! <sighs> this alley really is too narrow. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Let's do this! Oh! my Oh! What? Okay then, here I go! <laughs> <laughs> This alley is too narrow also. Yeah! Huh? What? Slow down! You're in danger! Kevin! Doug! Slow down! Huh? Holy! Oh! Holy, help us! <laughs> Look out! Are you two all right? I'm okay. Kevin, Doug, you know it's very dangerous to go that fast in the street. I just wanted to prove that my scooter is faster. No way! My skates are faster! It doesn't matter. What's way more important than going faster is going safer. Oh. On a side street like this, you'll find cars, cyclists, and pedestrians. When you go really fast on your skates or scooter, you won't be able to avoid people or cars, and you can get into accidents easily. Also, when you go downhill, you won't be able to slow down and can get into huge accidents. You're not kidding. I couldn't slow down at all. That's right. From now on, remember, only ride in safe places like your school's playground or the park. Don't ever ride on side streets or in parking lots. And when you ride with friends, don't race each other and be careful not to run into each other. You should know that the real way to be a winner is to always be safe. Okay? Yes, Polly. 
We'll remember. Huh. <laughs> Ready? And go! Huh? What are you doing? Voli told us the real way to win uh, is to always be the safest one. What? <laughs> I'm safer than you. <laughs> no, I'm going safer. Safety. I got it! Get him, Johnny! Hey! Take it, Charles! <laughs> Charles, are you all right? You should have had that. <sighs> Sorry. I'm not really good at sports at all. I can barely even catch a ball. Oh, Aww. then I take it back. You were right, just play. Charles, wait a second. Uh -huh. I'm sure there's something you're good at. <gasps> yeah, uh -huh. we'll find a sport you'll <laughs> like. You will? Hmm. There you go, all done. Uh -huh. Are you okay? It's always good to stretch before you start to play. That way, you'll be much less likely to pull a muscle. I'll do it from now on, Amber. Me too. Good, I'm glad. Uh, Charles, you ready? Uh, I guess. Uh, Great, here it comes. Ha! Uh, 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 oh, uh, my behind! Sorry, oh, mister, are you all right? Are you okay? I'm sorry! Uh, 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 Ready, Charles? Wow, look at that. You're doing great. Really? Go on. You can take a shot. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that was close. Maybe if you just watch me, do what I do. Ha! 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 See that? Shoot! Oh, no! Look out! <sighs> Don't ever run out into the road. You have to look. I'm sorry. You see you that? Don't do it like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're getting close. Just try it again. You're doing great. Whoa. Huh? <laughs> How did you get it up there? So now we don't even have a ball. Not a problem. Leave this ah. to me. Be careful. <sighs> Don't worry, this is a piece of cake. Uh, just a little farther. Almost there. Uh, uh, I got it! Uh, 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 Peter! Uh, I can't hold on for long, I'm gonna fall! Huh? Uh, Peter! Uh, I'll call for help. Uh, hold on, Peter! I can't hold on for much longer. Are you all right? Yes, thank you, Amber. That hoop is so high that you were very lucky you weren't hurt. I'm really sorry, Amber. I know a few rules that will keep you safe. Never hang from a soccer goal or a basketball hoop. You could be seriously injured. Be sure to stretch properly before you start to play or exercise. Be mindful of other people around you so they don't get hurt. Play in an open, safe area away from other people and cars. Never chase a ball into the street without checking if the coast is clear. Even better, ask an adult for help if possible. You guys can handle that, right? Yes! We, we can, can do, do that, that Amber! <laughs> <laughs>
You can do it, Charles. Come on! It's almost time to eat. Aw, oh, Mom, can't we have just one more? Only one. No, guys. I want you to still be hungry for this wonderful vegetable stew. Yeah. Huh? Here we are, ready to eat. Oh. oh mm. huh? What are you doing over there? Hot water is dangerous, Peter. There will be no more cocoa uh. for you. Uh. Huh? But oh, why, why not? not? Because you tried to go behind my back. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. Aww. Peter, I can't stop thinking of Coco. I know. We haven't had any in so long. Uh, I can't go on like this any longer! Ah! Uh, it's been long enough! Lucy, it's plan time. Plan time? We're calling this Operation Coco. Lucy and Buddy, are you ready? Yes! Now our target, obviously, is the kitchen cabinet. Our problem is that it's locked and the key is in Mom's room. When Mom leaves the room, we move in to secure the key. And then what? Mm -hmm. Hopefully, Posty will have Mom's package today. While Mom's busy with that, we move into the kitchen and hello, Coco! Wow! I'm going to have two cups of it! Once Mom goes downstairs, that Coco is mine! Mm -hmm. wow, wow. There's our signal. Move, move! Okay. Wait! This is where Mom usually keeps her keys. Where's the one in the cabinet? Peter, Peter! Huh? Mom has the key! It's all oh. over. Dear sweet Coco. No, not yet. Hmm. Hi, Mom. Huh? What is it, Lucy? It's, um, my new sock has a hole. Oh, no. Buddy must have gotten it again. I guess I'll sew it up. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? Uh, uh, it was in my hand. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, Robert? Posty's outside with my package. Huh? Thank you, Posty. Yes. Switch on. There. <laughs> Bye, Posty. <laughs> now what? Hmm. Uh. Buddy, you're up. <laughs> Buddy, that's not yours. <laughs> Buddy! Huh? I'll get it. Lucy? Huh? Peter? Huh? <laughs> Lucy, don't touch that! <laughs> oh, Mom! <laughs> Did you get hurt at all? I'm fine. <laughs> Peter, please call a rescue squad. <laughs> all right. <gasps> I'm all right for now. <laughs> there. You're all set. You did the right mm. thing. You'll be better in no time. Thank you, Amber. This might be the perfect time to go over some burn treatments. First, try to cool down the burn with cold water or saline. If it's covered, be sure to keep the cloth on. Gently wrap the burn with clean gauze or a bandage. Do not touch any blisters that form on the skin. 
If the burn is serious, immediately seek help from a hospital or clinic. But the best burn prevention is to be careful all the time. Don't play near the stove when it's on. Be sure your food is cool enough before you take a bite. Yes, great advice, Roy. <laughs> hey, Mom, I'm so sorry. I am too, Mom. Hmm. Well, at least we all learned something. How about a little cocoa now, yeah? Wow! Yeah! <laughs> oh no, the cocoa's all gone! What? It's gone? <sighs> well, I guess that's that. We'll just have to have cocoa another time. Wait, Hold Mom, on, Mom. Mom. We have to go to the store now! <laughs> Hi, Mom! Uh, let go, children. Oh, Mom! <laughs> School Zone Safety. Ooh, I won. <laughs> huh? Why is everybody stopping? The light hasn't turned red yet. Can't you see school bee up there ahead? We're stopped in the middle of a school zone. We're in the middle of a what? You can't beat this one. <laughs> oh, yeah? You're so childish. Hey, my car. My prize uh, possession. Uh, uh, Got you. Oh. well that ends well. <laughs> Come on, do you think you can pick up the pace? For huh? your information, uh -huh. I'm following the rules. You can't go any faster than this when you're in a school zone. Oh! oh! How could this possibly be? The number of school zone accidents? It says they're increasing. I agree. You should see the cars. They speed through without even looking at the signs. Oh, no! Children shouldn't have to worry about their safety when they're in a school zone. And it's not like we can close the schools. <laughs> I think the children would love that idea. I think that it's time we all reviewed the rules of the school zone. I was just on my way down there to direct traffic. I'll see if I can come up with any new ideas. Hey, Doug, look. Uh, uh Jenny, um, you don't need to wait for us today. Huh? How come? Well, you see, we have some business to attend to, so we're going the other way. <clears throat> oh, I see. You're going to buy more of those battle cards, aren't you? Okay, take care. <sighs> I wonder if they're ever going to grow up. Do you think today's the day we finally get the Super Fighter Elite card? <laughs> I hope so. You know, I've got a really good feeling about this. Whoa! Look at that airplane! Oh, yeah. oh, cool! <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah, I am. Toby, over Hi, here! Hi, Mom! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Look Rock, out. paper, scissors! Scissor. Rock, Rock, paper, scissors! Scissor. Wow. wow! I really hope I get the new card! Yeah, me too! Let's go! All right. Hmm. Oh, don't tell me! Stuck in the school zone again? Oh, wait! I can just sneak around the back! Thank you, Polly! Have a great afternoon. Ah, this looks good. Guess I'll go check the other gate. What? You're kidding me. All of these cards are worthless. I have them all. Oh. Doug, what's up? I hit the jackpot. Seriously? Finally, it's happened. The rare golden dragon. Oh. <laughs> yep. I should have found this road earlier. <laughs> oh, hey, look out, kid. Huh? Yeah, hey, wait. Stop. Watch the paint job, please. Hey, what's going on here? Don't you kids have chores to do? Huh. You can never be this. Uh, I can't believe this is happening. That card should have been you mine. You can't escape. <laughs> oh, these kids are everywhere. Oh, look out. Are you all right, kids? Holy! Oh, that was close. <sighs> it's a school zone. You knew that you had to obey the posted speed limit, didn't you? I'm sorry. Believe me, I had no idea there'd be so many kids running around. A school zone is designated as a safe area for children. When you see the sign, know there could be kids around. 
If you're in a hurry, you should use another route or start out earlier. Uh-huh. Kevin huh? and Doug, hmm? the same goes for you. Huh? Even though a school zone's supposed to be safe, you still have to be careful when you're out here. During the day, a lot of traffic and pedestrians travel back and forth past your school. The idea is for everyone to stay calm and alert. When you walk through the gates, make sure to watch where you're going and never ever play or run in the street. When you get off the school bus, it's very important to look before crossing in front of the bus. You could get seriously hurt. Oh, we get it, Polly. So you two aren't going to buy new cards today? We've moved on to some bigger and better things. Oh, yeah? That's right. Now we're playing this awesome new game called Ultimate mm -hmm. Wizard Warriors. Why am I not surprised? Goodbye, kids. Goodbye, Polly. So tell me about this Ultimate Wizard Warrior. No way. It's a secret. We promise not to tell. <laughs> Show up. Heave ho. Careful. All done. Now it's safe, Cleany. Thank you so much. <laughs> huh? Jin, something wrong? Looks like there's another beehive that needs to be moved. This one's at Cindy's house. All right. We'll go right away. Helly, mm -hmm. let's get to Cindy's house. You bet. <laughs> Goodbye, you guys. <laughs> Ta-da! Whoa! Super yum! Mm, it's the new double chocolate dream donut. I had to line up so early in the morning to get them. Ah! Oh, 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 ah it's a bee! <laughs> Just a tiny bee. Nothing to be scared of. Uh, Peter, look there! Look where? <laughs> when on earth did that big beehive get there? My donut! They're only selling that kind for one day! <sighs> Fine! Bees or not, that's my donut! Johnny! Johnny. Double chocolate dream! Johnny, you all right? Well, at least I managed to rescue one. <laughs> no! Oh. Ah, I have an idea that might work. Easy does it. Little bit more. Just uh, hurry up! Back uh, off! Uh, Let me do it! Ha! Uh, you got it! Awesome! Uh, 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 close the door! Hurry! Uh, uh, oh, my donut! It's gone forever! Oh. <gasps> uh, Aha! Mm -hmm. Guys, I need your help. Huh. Mm -hmm. huh. Uh. Boxman, ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> Operation Rescue Donuts. Peter's the man. I have eyes on the donuts, moving deep into enemy territory. Three seconds until donut rescue. Two seconds. One second. Mission success! Yahoo! He did it! <laughs> now I walk out. Huh? Oh! Oh! Go! Go away! Huh? Run for your life! Huh? What's that sound? Bees are chasing the kids! Johnny! Hey, kids! I'm coming! 
nobody got stung? <gasps> yeah, we're okay. <sighs> <laughs> we'll be happy to take the beehive. <sighs> Thanks, Thanks a lot, lot, children. Let me tell you what to do if you ever run into bees. Listen up. When you find bees, don't try to get rid of them yourselves. Just quietly move away. If you find a beehive, do not touch it. Just call the authorities and it will be removed safely. If bees chase you, cover your head and lie down. Protect your body. If a bee stings you, don't touch it and go to the nearest hospital for treatment. You can remember that, right? Sure, sure Amber, Amber, of, of course. course! I think it's time to eat some donuts, you guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm starving. <gasps> There's another bee! <gasps> no! My double chocolate dream! <laughs> Never forget to turn off the gas. Mom, what are you doing? <gasps> Strawberries? <laughs> We're making strawberry jam today. It's so good on bread. Yay, awesome! Ooh, strawberries, yeah! Stop that! These are for strawberry jam. Come on, you've got plenty of them there. Children, stop fighting and be good until the jam's ready, all right? Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy jam! I'm about to die of hunger. It's almost done. <sighs> Just have to let it simmer down. So, can I have a little taste? Back up! Hey, what's your problem? Jam is for eating on huh? bread. Huh? It's traditional. Uh -huh. Lucy, fetch some bread from the living room. Yes, Mom. <laughs> hey. Huh? Oh. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Mommy, look. <gasps> <laughs> My bread! Bad dog! Lucy, we'll get more bread! Don't cry! <laughs> Lucy, want me to carry the bread? No! I have to protect it from the bad, naughty dog! <laughs> he probably ate the jam while we were gone! Oh, no! <gasps> Mom, hurry! Buddy's eating all the jam! Relax, Lucy. The jam is still up on the stove, so Buddy can't get it! <gasps> Children, I think I forgot to turn the stove off! What happens when you don't turn it off? The jam might start to burn, and there could be a fire! <gasps> oh, the jam will burn up? The jam isn't the problem. The whole house could burn down. <laughs> no! no! Look out! Huh? 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 <laughs> 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 So you're all right uh, down there. I'm just fine, thanks. <laughs> We're almost home. <gasps> Come on, hurry up, Mom. <gasps> Kids, just follow your mom. <laughs> <gasps> this way's blocked too. Come on. Oh, Mom, what'll happen if Buddy of our house burns down? <laughs> No, that must not happen! Come oh, on! <laughs> Here, this should work. <gasps> Come on, we're going home! You are You're really awesome, Mom! Look out, Lucy! Lucy! Just a little bit further now. Peter! 
Peter, Boy. is something wrong? But he's all by himself at home. And I didn't remember to turn off the stove. Let's get there. Buddy! 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 Huh? <gasps> huh? Uh, hi. What's going on? Buddy! <laughs> <laughs> It's a good thing Robert turned off the stove, or it could have been a real disaster. Sorry, Roy. I should have been more careful. I'll give you a couple of safety tips for using the stove. When the stove is in use, never leave it unattended. The pot might overheat and start a fire, or the ingredients may overflow and cause a gas leak. Also, before using the stove, make sure that there's no smell of gas in the air. If you start the stove when there is a gas leak, it could explode, so please always check. Also, make sure that the fire is fully lit. If the knob is turned while the fire is off, the gas could leak. Lastly, always remember to turn off the gas valve after using the stove. If you're worried you might forget, installing a gas timer might be a helpful precaution. We will. Thank you, Roy. Hey, Mom, can we please have some jam? Yes, <laughs> yeah. but where is the jam? <laughs> I left it on the table. Uh, oh, 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 buddy! buddy. <laughs> Streetwise. Wow! That looks good! Thanks, but this one isn't for you. It's a surprise present for Mrs. Rora. It's her birthday today. May I have one teensy slice? If she gets yeah. one, so should I. Don't worry. Huh? I'll bake for you, too. Yahoo! <laughs> I really want a pie. Yeah? Well, I'd like to trade Mom's pie for some of Mrs. Rora's chocolate chip cookies. Hey, me too, me too. <laughs> Cab's supposed to deliver the pie, but he's running a little late. It's going to get huh? cold. I can take it to her. Huh? Really? <laughs> it's not too far. Please, let me go. All right. And while you're gone, I'll bake a pie for you, okay? Yeah! And I'm going to come oh. too. What do you mean? It's huh? too far, Susie. You just said it isn't far. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, kids. Uh, Wish Mrs. Rora a happy birthday uh, for me. Uh, Mom, I don't want to take her. If Susie listens to you, there won't be any problems. Right, Kevin? Uh, no. Will you listen to Kevin? Yes! <laughs> Go straight to the main road, Kevin. Yeah. Uh, Susie, hurry up, will ya? The pie's gonna get cold. I'm trying. Huh? Kevin, where are you going? This is the shortcut to Mrs. Rora's. But Mom told us to go straight to the main road. It's okay. I know the way better than Mom. Are you sure? Sure, I'm sure. Okay, Cab, you're <sighs> all set. I feel like new, Amber. Oh. oh, boy. Gotta run an errand for Kevin's mom. Huh? Bye, Cab. We'll see you again soon. Whoa! This street is weird. Why do the cars come so close? Well, see, this is kind of a road, okay? Oh. Oh. Okay, pal, back up. I came in first. What are you talking uh, about? I was here uh, first. You uh, back up. This is you scary. Uh, don't don't worry about them, in. Susie. Do We're do almost there. I think this way might be faster. Kevin, I'll take it for a while. Oh, thanks, Susie. What happened, Cab? Holy! <laughs> you okay, Susie? That pie was for Mrs. Rora! Oh, it's okay. I'm sure that Mrs. Rora will be very happy that both of you are safe. Cab, I'm surprised. You know you need to be extra careful and watch for pedestrians in alleys like this. I'm sorry. It's huh? all my fault, Polly. Kevin, Susie, 
There are some simple rules you should always follow when you walk in places where there's no sidewalk, and I'd like to teach them to you. Okay. First, always walk along the side of the road, not in the middle. If you walk in the middle, you can't see cars coming behind you, and that's dangerous. Second, always stop and move to the side when cars want to get by. Walk after they pass. Drivers can't always see you. Always stop and look carefully before crossing. Never run out. Third, when you walk on a narrow road, don't walk side by side. Always walk in a line. And it's not a good idea to carry anything on the side the cars are on. If one gets too close, a little bump can cause a big accident. So follow the rules, and even a walk down a narrow road can be a lot safer for everybody. Okay, Polly. That's great, but the pie's ruined. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. Mom's baking another one. That's right. <laughs> Mrs. Rora, we're here. Oh, what a surprise. Happy birthday, Mrs. Mrs. Rora. How oh, sweet. This is a pie for you from my mom. Oh, well, isn't that thoughtful? Come on in. I think I have something for you, too. <laughs> Wow! Chocolate chip cookies! These are my favorite cookies in the whole world! They're my favorite cookies in the whole entire universe! Well, I must admit, <laughs> I like them too. 